Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to our today's walk and talk here at Form Next 2021 in Frankfurt. I've been invited by Dr. Markus Hering. He is managing director of the working group additive manufacturing at VDMA and he will take me to a tour around the VDMA uh, group booth. Markus, thanks for having me and uh, I'm so much looking forward to the topics that the VDMA members have brought to Form Next. Good morning, nice to have you here. What is the, uh, the main topic that you are presenting this year? Did it change in comparison to last year's? A little bit. First of all, we show a lot of using cases, use cases, what our members are producing, what they are using in, in daily life in, in industrial processes. Uh -huh. um, and in addition to that, uh, we have uh, an activity started a couple of months ago, um, OPC UR based, so that means interconnection between machines. Um, belong the process chain, um, we, have, we have a lot of individual steps and to, to combine these um, individual steps and to make it uh, possible that each machine, each step is able to um, collaborate and communicate to the next step, we develop an OPCUR standard so that everybody who is producing machines is able to have um, to bring that machine I into the procedure. Mm -hmm. This is something um quite common in other industries, right? In the it machine yeah. uh, uh, building uh, um, industries, um, we see that since decades. But this is rather new to the AM community, right? Um, it's, it's new to the AM community, but it's also new for mechanical engineering at all. So um, we, we have a lot of section groups within VDMA what started this procedure, um, some of them a couple of years ago, um, but it's, it's for all new. It's, it's part of uh, Industry 4.0 um, to open the communication to machines on an open platform. Okay, and I would love to see the exhibits that you have here on the booth. Let's take a walk. Yeah, we will do. <laughs> Right, so additive for industry is one of the slogans here on your booth. What does it stand for? We, we have a look um, about the, the opportunities, the possibilities of additive um, using for industrial applications. Uh -huh. uh, and you see here um, at, our, at our booth some, some benefits. So you have flexibility um, in production. Um, you, you are able to produce in lightweight, in bionic structures. Um, you are able to repair uh, things. You are able to produce spare parts um, directly in the place where you need it. So the, um, you avoid transport cost with this um, and you have a lot of benefits in, in additive um, manufacture using for the industry. These are assets that one single company couldn't ever offer. So this is only possible in teamwork, right? And that's why you established this working group. I guess additive is more than all the other industry um, a teamwork. So yeah, you have to work together with other players. Um, you have a process chain that means, that means you need process technology uh, in the center, but also um, pre-press um, solutions. You need software, you need uh, post-treatment technologies. Um, and to bring that to an industrial application, um, you need the common approach of all involved uh, players um, at the process chain. Really impressive, <laughs> great. <laughs> Okay, so Markus, you have shown me a lot of exhibits here, uh, but I would like to know what is your personal highlight here at Form Next 2021? We have, we have seen this year not a real revolution in technology, we have seen a, more an evolution. So uh -huh. uh, some, some uh, optimizing in processes, some inline optimization, um, but I have seen one real new technology um, in metal printing and that's called liquid metal printing and I have here some samples uh -huh. um, you see they use the, the polymer technology so that means they're melting up the metal drop by drop and then bring it together um, to one piece at the end um, and you see here a result okay but so this is what alloy is it it's aluminium okay that's fascinating. So the two worlds are growing together, the polymer additive manufacturing and the metal one. Yeah, and it will be interesting to see um, what are the benefits at the end and what are the possible applications for this. It's just brand new and for me really interesting and exciting. <laughs> I can understand why that is your highlight. <laughs> yeah. Okay, 
Markus. So thank you very much for this tour around your booth. What will be the future topics? What will we see at next Formex here in Frankfurt in the year 2022? Uh, a good question, of course, I don't know exactly, <laughs> but, but I see a trend um, over all industry and also a trend what is coming up for additive more and more, and that is sustainability. So the, um, the, the benefits, um, the, the sustainable benefits of additive manufacturing, um, as well as closing the circle um, for the use of materials for additive, that will be coming up and I, I'm pretty sure that will be a topic for next year. Sounds exciting. Thanks a lot and thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye.